From a high vantage point, you get a reminder of the steep hills next to Interstate 84 in the Columbia Gorge. Work is still underway along the roadway to cut and remove trees badly damaged by the massive wildfire last summer. The flames stole hillsides worth of plants that are vital to keeping the soils where they are when the heavy rains fall, as they will tonight. It has some business owners like David Lips wary. He and his partners at the Thunder Island Brewing Company in Cascade Locks suffered through the two-week closure of I-84 during the wildfires. The last thing they need now is a massive slide that shuts off traffic again. Yeah, uh, with you know all the stuff happening in California, that's definitely uh, a concern. On the upside, business is actually a tad better this winter over last. Of course, last year at this time there was an ice storm. Highway crews say they've done all they can to prepare for trouble including putting this backhoe at Tomalt Creek, a regular flooding spot. Back at Cascade Locks, the manager of the main grocery store said he personally is not worried about slides, but knows that many others are. But there's definite concern, I mean, all up and down the gorge. The Oregon Department of Transportation this time of year has workers on these interstate 24-7. So if things get dicey tonight, they'll put up warnings on their electronic reader boards about water on the roadway, possible slide danger. But be careful if you're coming out this way. Back to you. Pat, thank you. Now